They're getting into the Capitol tonight. They're getting in there. Democrats will rely heavily on the scores of video from January 6, pro-Trump supporters storming the U.S. Capitol. The argument by the House impeachment managers that the mob was spurred on for months and then further incited the morning of. You'll never take back our country with weakness. You have to show strength. Just hours from the start of his second impeachment trial, President Trump's legal team filed a 78-page brief pushing back, arguing he has the right to free speech. President Trump's defense team will argue that Trump's statements were protected by the First Amendment, um, that these are essentially uh, opinion-based statements um, and that his statements can't be linked to the actions of people. Legal experts say this defense will be tough to uphold and we can expect the Democrats to show video of rioters saying they were following their president's orders. Andrew Sidman is an associate professor of political science at John Jay College. 67 senators, more specifically 17 Republicans, will need to vote for impeachment. It appears unlikely there will be enough votes to convict Mr. Trump. Professor Sidman says there is a different different debate on hand. There's still a very open question about whether the Republican Party is going to remain a, a party that is very centered around Donald Trump or if the Republican Party is going to, to move beyond President Trump. The defense also calling the impeachment case an act of, quote, political theater. The trial will begin with a debate and vote on whether it's even constitutional to prosecute a former president. If Trump is convicted, Democrats can hold a vote to prevent him from holding office ever again. Each side will have ample time to make arguments. If the managers decide they want witnesses, there'll be a vote on that. And opening arguments will begin at noon and each side will have up to 16 hours each to present their case. Uh, the former president has declined a request for him to testify. Reporting live tonight, I'm Shirley Chan, PIX11 News.